Hi everybody, Robert Dyer and welcome, welcome to the Robert Dyer Channel Christmas Countdown where today I have a classic product that's always been a part of Christmas for me as those of you who've been subscribers for many years know eggnog is always a big part of Christmas and this is the original eggnog that I've had the earliest as a child which is Borden eggnog and this is the first time I've been able to find it since I started doing these Christmas countdowns uh, this used to come in a tall metal can and you would punch a hole in the top and then it disappeared in recent years and it popped up again this year at Giant in this new environmental package and it's also resealable unlike the old one you had to put a plastic bag over it or something put it in the refrigerator now the history of eggnog was that back in the 18th century eggnog was the drink of the upper class in England because only they could afford to have the fresh eggs and milk there were no refrigerators obviously and then they would add brandy to this and they would make eggnog so it's always been considered the beverage of the rich now it's available for everyone and here you have the Elsie the cow logo up there and that character was created in 1936 and became famous as an actual cow in 1939 when she was in the exhibit of Borden at the New York uh, the World's Fair of 1939 when they had an automatic milking machine and there's actually in Plainsboro, New Jersey is a the grave of Elsie the cow that's apparently a uh, tourist stop there not as much of a spice aroma as some of the more recent eggnogs have let's go ahead and see how it tastes it's a bit thicker than the most of the modern eggnogs it does not have as much of a spice flavor sorry Bob I was just watching the argument between Rand Paul and Freddy Krueger about Cuba on Snapchat. Both men are expected to be presidential candidates in 2016. Fred Krueger's slogan will be, it's nighttime in America. He's well equipped to deal with America's threats domestic and abroad. Are you ready for Freddy? Bob, you knucklehead. Oh, hi. I'm at the Crystal Forest Mall doing some Christmas present shopping. Can you guess who's present I'm trying to pick out? I'll give you a hint. He says, oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. <laughs> Go ahead. Try to guess. Somebody tell Paul Blart 
to track that knucklehead down. Well, I find that this has, uh, while those who prefer more of a spice element in their eggnog, this makes up for that in being quite rich, much thicker, and a lot of uh, cream and egg flavor. I know it says heavy cream on here, so I would say that this is still a great eggnog from when I was a child, and I'm going to go ahead and give this five stars. I hope you like this video. Share it with your friends. Please subscribe, and I'll see you next time on this Christmas countdown. Bye, everybody.